hey guys it's your girl again with another video i know i started this hair before coming on camera just because this is like an hour video long and i don't want i don't want to keep you guys watching every bit of you know everything that i do so um for the most part um i'm pretty sure some of you already know um how to Pamrod, so I'm just gonna show you guys how I do mine. Everybody have their way. So this is the product I am using, and is the Abin um, Foaming Curls, and that's the only product I'm using for this hairstyle. So um, make sure when you're applying um, it or whatever you're using for your Pamrods, make sure you apply generous amounts because that will help the curls to pop real good. And make sure you apply from the roots to the tips of your hair because you want to make sure that you are getting enough product on it and when you are done with that uh, make sure you you know comb the hair and uh, when combing the hair you make sure you comb it from the roots um, to the root uh, from the tips to the roots because um, you don't want to pull it from the roots because you uh, may cut your hair, it may be tangled up. So you want to start from the tips um, to the roots. So, um, so as usual, I'm just going to go ahead and use my um, rollers. So I decided I'm going to use orange rollers. At the back, I use like a pink roller, just like three of them but um, I am using an orange roller for this style um, that's because um, I want the curls to be um, set in size this size and that's the reason why I decided I'm gonna use that so basically um, when you're doing your um, cameras make sure when you uh, laying the tips just make sure you lay it real flat and make sure it's not like lifting because that's where your curls are gonna be popping real good so what I did I, um, I need to explain when it has to do with uh, my hair you know starting from the back to the front so basically what I did I separated the front part as you can see it's in the ponytail so that that way when I get to that point the um, pen rods that I'm going to be applying is going to be um, coming forward and not going backwards as you can see um, this other ones that I'm doing is uh, I'm, I'm actually pen rodding it going backwards so but um, when I get to that front part it's going to be a different ball game as you can see your girl is so tired like my hands were burning but um i got it together so i'm gonna get um this completed off camera and i'm gonna come back to you guys when i'm working on the front part so i don't waste your time so we made it to the front ooh, 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 i'm so excited that that uh, makes me feel so happy because I can see the end of the tunnel <laughs> oh my goodness I am so excited so um, as you can see I am um, getting my part I'm parting what exactly I need in the direction I want the curls to fall so that's just a tip for you wherever you want your curls to fall make sure you part it in that very direction so that uh, your um, hair can fall in that direction and wherever you want it to fall roll your roller roll the hair um to that direction as well i'm not sure if i'm making any sense but um so what i'm doing right now i am gonna roll this forward because i want it to fall in front of my face so that's what i mean so um you already know my routine you know I'm not gonna say too much, speak too much. I'm just gonna let you guys watch to see uh, what I'm doing in the front. So um, I'm a visual person. I gotta see exactly what you're talking about, and I just listen to what you're saying. So 
I'm just gonna let you guys uh, watch what I do this one um, coming to the front so you guys can really understand what I'm talking about so of course that's the roller I'm using and you can see the way I brought it forward brought my head forward rolling it forward or whatever <laughs> I'm not sure how you guys if you guys really understand me but I am rolling it forward so that the curls can fall in my face that's what I am trying to say <laughs> so um just an um fyi this here is not easy um pam rod it's not easy but i'm not discouraging you um but it is worth it because at the end of the um, whole thing you will love it like it is so beautiful so um, what i'll say nothing good comes easy you gotta work hard to get what you want right that's just life in general so um it wasn't easy at all but yeah it came out real good and i'm just gonna uh fast forward this so i don't keep you guys watching the same thing and so we can get this video completed um as fast as I want it to be because <laughs> I really don't want to waste your time real talk I am on my last one I am so excited y'all you have no idea Ooh wee I am so 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 like tired as well but I cannot wait to be done <laughs> So anyways guys, um let you guys watch and we are gonna wrap this up. <laughs> if we can just find a way, then we can live a better day. Rise from the ashes from the angle from the wall. Let's come together, lift your spirit So guys your girl is tired so this is how it looked like i'm gonna turn around spin around so you guys can see i only have the three pink rolls at the back and that's it that's my 350 and give me a hug i'm so ready to go to bed and sleep <laughs> good morning family i am so excited and um i actually left this hair for to air dry for 48 hours rather than 24 hours sometimes i just you know sleep and wake up and take it down and if it's not 100 percent dry i kind of um use my blow dryer and don't even say anything about my blow dryer because some people don't like heat in their hair but i am low peroxide so I, my hair loves heat that's the only way my hair accepts products so um whatever products i apply on my hair if i don't use heat um it's not gonna get into my follicles because my follicles are closed that's the only way my follicles can open and accept the product so my hair loves heat so but anyways you can see the curls are looking so delicious <laughs> delicious haha <laughs> But the hair is looking so good. I'm so excited. It came out really good. So I'm going to go ahead and take out this Pam Rods off camera. Come back and show you guys the final look. And I'm going to dress it up. And um, we are going to see how it came out. And you're going to judge yourself. <laughs> so I am done taking down the Pam Rods. So now I'm going to use my growth oil. And it's a combination of different oils that is uh, great for low peroxide here so it is lightweight basically and I'm just you know I'm making sure I get it in my scalp so that um, I can have some um, you know oil so I don't want I don't just I just don't want my scalp to be dry and I want the oil to help my hair grow as well <laughs> that's of course one of um our dreams to um help our hair grow so but anyways i'm gonna go ahead and style this hair with my um um what they call that now pick comb and uh first of all before the pick comb that's the oil I'm, i used so um part of the oil that i use 
so before the peak comb i'm gonna separate these curls one at a time that's the only what well, that's one of the time consuming thing so i have to separate it one at a time and i'm gonna come back and um style the hair when i am done separating this this is gonna take a minute so i'm not gonna just keep you guys watching me separating the curls so and this will help the curls to like um um look really good so you guys are gonna see the results when i'm done so we are done separating the curls and i'm gonna use this my apricot oil and just like put it on the hair and so i can get a little bit of shine to it and i'm gonna go ahead and start picking the hair this is the peak comb i'm gonna be using i bought this from amazon and um, it came in three different sizes and this is the size i really love to use this will help your hair to get some volume like after you separate the curls you just use this like to pick it um as much as you want and you get the volume that you want so um, i'm gonna go ahead and pick this and I'll come back and show you guys my final look with the um after i'm done picking it this is the final look i love this you guys let me know what you think if it came out real good give me a thumbs up if you like it if you're gonna try it, give me a thumbs up let me know in the comment section if you're gonna try this and yeah uh, let me know if you prefer this fro look or the mohawk look and like let me know if you prefer the mohawk look so please Put that in the comment section so i know um if um which so i know which of the style is better anyways thank you so much for watching if you haven't subscribed yet please go ahead and give um subscribe it is 399 and it is a red button either here or here not really sure but go ahead and hit the subscribe button i think i'm going to be doing a lot of natural hair videos because i believe that a lot of natural girls are really struggling on what to do with their hair so i i am part of them and um you know going natural is always like a struggle with hairstyles so I, i'm like you know what i need to spice it up you know so i can look good even with my natural hair so i don't get tempted to go put some relaxer in my hair which i have done and done and done and done several times and this time i'm like i am done my hair is like one year old no relaxer nothing so um, i have a falsy hair you guys already seen it in the video like the beginning part that i have a falsy hair my hair is very 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 hard to deal with the falsy girls you know what i'm talking about our hair for any reason it doesn't curl up <laughs> you have to do a lot to it so and um if you don't do nothing to your hair it don't look good well it looks good because it's natural i love my hair but um it don't look like something I want to wear out. That's what I mean. So, um, this hair is a great hairstyle for my natural fussy hair girls. And, um, I'm going to be doing a lot of natural hairstyles. So, as to help you guys know the styles to do with your hair. So, you're not stuck with one style or stuck with, um, um, you know, tying up your hair every time. But anyways, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and share with somebody and I...